Okay, now this is the tricky part. What tricky part? It's overcast. Go. So we have to descend below the clouds because if we stay above the clouds, then we're going to get trapped. Yeah, but the overcast is above the airport in a range of uh, five miles. Five miles around the airport. We can uh, find the parts be before. We don't have to go now. Right? It's, it's up to you. No, no, no. I'm However, sure. you see how the clouds are. Kilo, about 30 minutes ago, the tops over to Florence Airport reported that at 1,500. Uh, report at uh, 1,500, kilo. It's, um. Uh, Right now, three six popping Yankee contact Myrtle Beach approach one two seven point four. Good day. It's few to scattered, but when we get a little closer, it's gonna get to overcast. So we're about twenty five minutes from the airport, thirty five miles. I would start a descent, nice and easy. Make sure, make sure. I got descent checklist. I got descent checklist for you. Don't throttle back until you do a descent checklist. First of all, you do a descent checklist. So, descent checklist. Carburetor heat on, fuel selector on the proper tank. Altimeter instrument compass. That's Altimeter instrument compass. So, mixture rich. And descent checklist complete. You can keep, keep 2,500, 2,400 on the descent this way. We're descending 500 feet per minute, and we're keeping the speed, keeping the speed down on the descent. So you see how it's turning overcast? Yeah, yeah, getting. I mean, you still see some holes in the sky, but. This should be a good landing because the wind is calm. Yeah. So don't disappoint me. Panticles! <laughs> we take jigs up to the sky. of fuel, no problem. I think we can, if the wind is as good as, it, as this is, I think we can squeeze all the way to Florida from uh, Lawrence. Now we'll have a good car. I think speed. if we get up Go. there, if we get up there and get some nice tailwinds and lean the mixture nice and lean, we got to make three, four, five, uh, almost four hours. We can do four hours. As long as the weather is VFR, we descend right in, because if you see you're getting low... Five, Bravo Victor, contact Myrtle Beach, approach 119.2, good day. 92, Bravo Victor, good day. If you see you're getting low on fuel, you can always divert and land somewhere close, like Jacksonville or a little bit closer. But, you know, this is almost a three-hour flight, and we still got plenty of gas. When you're coming in to land, I notice your corrections are very slow and aggressive. You want to have little tiny corrections, okay? And keep the tail behind and keep on dancing. Now, if you see that it wants to bounce, don't over control. Let it bounce and then hold it in that pitch attitude until it settles back in there. Because when it bounces and you push the nose down, you hit the ground, and it bounces further, and it gets worse. Yeah. So you're getting in nice and easy, it bounces a little bit, hold that pitch, let it settle back in there, and tweak it. It takes a lot of finesse, but you can do it. It takes a lot of effort. As long as you're not getting dangerous and getting all over the place, I'm not going to take over. But if you see that I reach for the power, 
that means it's no good. We're trying to get around, you know, go around because it's like getting out of control. So, okay. And you can do the same thing. You don't have to wait for me to go around. If you think it's not right, yeah, like yesterday, like yeah, yesterday, yeah, put yeah, the power yeah. On. yeah, put the power in. Yeah, yeah if yeah. you think it's not right, just. I'll put the power in and go around, no problem. Better off. Oh, here, in the nice spots. It's yeah. always, yeah, we got plenty of room to go through, yeah. It's always better to go around than get in trouble, you know? Floors approach uh, November 1797 kilo is now 4,500 feet, descending 1,500 feet. November 97 kilo, Roger. <coughs> Airport elevation. 157. 147. 147. Okay. So we got the uh, traffic pattern of 1100, right? Yep. You see how we're getting further south and you can see how it's getting overcast. Mainland 4161 out of 1000 for 3000 runway heading. Mainland 4161, Florence departure, rate of contact, climb and maintain 10,000, turn left right Chesterfield. 10,000 right Chesterfield, and uh, it's kind of scattered and broken here, ragged bottoms going in at about 1,000 to 1,500. Mainland 4161, Roger. Can you hear the radio good? Yeah, okay. Who is the runway? Who's the active? Runway 9. See if you can load up the GPS first, runway 9. Oh, you gotta get rid of uh, these Four, two destinations. Good morning, Charlie Whiskey, 8000, direct Charlotte. Go ahead, stop Number one, Charlie Whiskey, it's Point Charlotte. Good morning, Point South Seminary, 2994. Stop navigation, stop navigation. Go ahead, sir. There you go, now proceed direct, Florence. Number one, Charlie Whiskey, cleared to the Charlie Airport via Chesterfield. Kilo, Fox Run. Chesterfield 3, arrival to Red. Maintain 8000. 8,000 direct Chesterfield for the Chesterfield 3, 1 Charlie Whiskey. Enter, activate. Now flight plan. Select approach. ILS 9, that's good. See if you have RNAV 9, maybe better. Yeah, put RNAV 9, that's good. Excellent. Perfect, you put it in there. You're basically planning this way. So it's left traffic for 9. Getting warmer. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Very, very nice. Nice speed. Very nice speed. What is the final approach, please? Got a 
load up the approach, oh, okay, okay, okay. and then it'll give you the final approach fix. Emovi. Emovi. What's this line? This is uh, an approach line to each runway. This is for runway 19, 27, 1, and 9. Okay. There's four runways on that airport. Four runways? First, good morning, sir. Number 63, Papa Victor, right now. Number 63, Papa Victor, Florence Punch. Good morning, Florence. I'll send her 2994. 94. Number seven kilo dash eight just departed Florence reported the um, cloud layer from 1,000 to 1,500 scattered to broken. Close it at the seven kilo. When you get below the clouds at 1,500, you can tell him uh, nine seven kilo is uh, 1,500. VFR below the clouds. It's not going to be 1,000, it's going to be 1,000. You want to go down to 1,000? Okay. Yeah. And it's going to be bumpy. <laughs> well, I think below the clouds is nice, but as you're coming down, it's going to pick up some bumps. Nice and warm down here, isn't it? Yeah. Hey, give him a call. Uh, 97 yeah. kilo, 1,200 VFR below. First approach, uh, this is November 1797 kilo. It's now 1,200 feet below the clouds, VFR. November 97 kilo, Roger. about the ground speed eh? <laughs> uh, about 80 now it's not bad just it's gonna be bumpy below the clouds because you got all the it's gonna be bumpy we'll have to reduce the speed uh, I mean it's not that bumpy I would keep the speed I would keep the same power same 2400 2500 it's good runs nice and smooth Actually, a little better ground speed down here. Yeah. How fast were we going up at 65? Uh, it was 70, 70 something, right? 78. Yeah, 70 something. Yeah, yeah. 75. Yeah, I think most of the headwinds are gone now. Say 1,000 feet. Yeah, 1,000 is good. You. It's because of the heat of the sun. Okay, good yeah, 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 yeah. Sure, it's it's four, seven, one Victor's level five thousand. Sun is heating the ground. Four, seven, one Victor, Good afternoon. Four, seven, two, nine, nine, four. Nine, nine, four, seven.
seven one day. Obstacle. Speed rises. Obstacle. So it's warming up the air on the ground. Yeah, it's okay. I don't see any obstacles. Good. It's warming up the air on the ground and creating uplift. Yeah, and yeah. that's why it gets bumpy. And you're right below the cloud deck, so that's another reason why. Why so here? Why so here? It's telling you that there's obstacles, but, yeah, but I why? don't see any obstacles. I'm looking outside. There's one antenna to the right, 500 feet. Yeah. And another one to the left here, about 300 feet, so I don't see any problems. And you can see them if you zoom in. See? This is one to the left, one to the right. And you're going right between these. Oh, uh, right here. Yep. 1,000 feet, you're fine. You're not going to have any problems. See? Look. It's giving you caution, but it's not necessarily... Telling you that you're gonna hit any obstacle. Uh, number one, Charlie Whiskey. Uh, Charlotte is in a south operation today. Climb and maintain one zero thousand for the arrival. One zero thousand, one Charlie Whiskey. Descending a little bit too early because you still see the hole in the clouds. I told you, how yeah. fast is we how many other fast is? Yeah, we could have uh, the, uh, kept on staying high the because it's much, uh, much smoother up there. What is the age of your number 97 kilo to Florence Airport? It's about your um, 11 o'clock, 10 zero miles. Contact tower 125.1. 125.1 uh, one uh, for uh, 97 kilo. Uh, thank you. Five, one, two, five, point one. Okay. Lawrence Tower, eh? Yeah, yeah. Man of seven kilo, yeah. fifteen miles Six to the miles. northeast, information uniform. I think they changed it to uniform. Yeah? Yeah. What's the age? You can check. I think they changed it. Yeah. One, two, three point six two five. One, two, three point five. I'm gonna say no ages. Ah, uh, you should be able to pick up the ages. There's no ages. The 2365? Yeah. Check it again. Look. Okay. Yeah, 2362. 2362. Feeling 1,200 overcast. Temperature 242.20, half temperature 2994. Alice approaching east lane runway 9 or departing runway 9. Approaches are being conducted at intersecting runways. Read back all runway holds for instructions. Survives on contact. You have information uniform. Uniform. Yeah, it's uniform. I remember uniform. Florence Tower, uh, this is November 1797 kilo, it's about uh, 13 miles uh, northeast of the airport, inbound uh, with uh, uniform. We're 1797 
Nine Kilo, Forest Tower, Roger, enter a midfield left downwind for runway Niner. And report your midfield left downwind. Report uh, midfield uh, left downwind or runway Niner, uh, Niner 7 Kilo. Okay, we got an antenna. I saw that. Don't worry, I saw that. Uh, about 12 o'clock. Tell you what, the airport's a little bit to the left. Let's go towards the airport to the left. Yeah. The airport? Yeah. And then enter midfield left valley. They'll keep us away from this antenna. Okay. Yeah, much better. You can go direct, go flight plan, and direct to runway 9. That would work. Oh. See the airport now pretty clear. Wanna do uh, instrument or just uh, take the foggles and do VFR? Um, yeah, I'm gonna do VFR. VFR, okay. Windsor calm. Yes. I think if we climb up high, <clears throat> clean the mixture, we can do direct to Florida from here. Maybe, yes. I think that's a good plan. That's what keep us... That'll give us about four legs to Florida. See? Yes. Jersey, Virginia, South Carolina, Florida. Because the wind is improving. It's not as much headwind now. Just make sure you don't drink too much. You drink too much, we have to stop in Georgia to pee. <laughs> I don't drink. Don't worry. Oh, you had some coffee in Virginia. Yeah, yeah, you had some coffee. is it now? 10.30, wow that's good, this was a good lick. 3.2 That was a good flight. 
Oh, okay, Flores Tower, this is November 1797 Kilo is now uh, mid, uh, uh, midfield uh, left downwind for runway 9. 797 Kilo, Flores Tower, runway 9 are clear to land. Clear to land, uh, runway 9 or 97 Kilo. Checklist. Navigator hit off. Make sure on. Do the select all right. Let's go. Let's get it. Alright, let's do it. 1100. You know where the FBO is? Where the fuel? No. Uh, it's supposed to be close to the tower, right? Yeah, it's a left turn. Make a left turn, you'll see the FBO. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that, downtown Florence. North Carolina, we skip from Virginia all the way down. Nice place, eh? Yeah! But Last time I landed here was nighttime. I didn't see much. Oh, okay. Now you can see more. 329 or zero kilo, Florence Crown, you cleared Charleston Mass. File, climb, maintain 2000. Expect 10,000, Windsor Metro to departure. Departure frequency 118.6. Squawk 4376. Three, two, nine, zero kilo, reback crate. You did say you had uniform. Sir Kilo Roger. Uh, winds are 180, actually winds calm. Text runway 19 or via uh, Delta Bravo. How's your trim on landing? You trim nose up or you keep the trim the same? Ah, I need that piece. Yeah, you want to have nose up trim. You want to come in a nice stabilized approach. It'll make your landing easier. Slightly low. At least that's for a go out. There you go. want to keep the throttle easy. Gotta be a little bit quicker with the corrections. Don't be too solid, you know? Okay, so those are the nice and easy. Very nice. Very nice. You fixed it with a little bit of zip on the power. Did a wonderful job. Very nice. Gotta make the first lift. Watch it. Number 1797 Kilo, just turn left at Bravo. Turn left on um, Bravo, 907 Kilo. 1797 Kilo, just remain this frequency for ground. And uh, turn left on Bravo, and then turn left on Delta. And taxi around via Delta. Taxi via Delta, and stay on this frequency, 907 Kilo. Okay. Bravo, and then Delta is the next one left. And the ramp is right there, you see Shell? Yeah, that's where the ramp is. You got a little back.
bounce and you add a power and then you kind of smooth it out a little bit and it was much better. Notice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, turn left here, left on delta.